All right, all right, all right. This is Intuitive Empress coming to you with a- another message for the sign of Scorpio. And this is Secret Messages from the Karmic. All right. And so this is based on the poll that I sent out. And hands down, Karmic Messages came out. So we're going to find out what's going on with the Karmic. Okay. I do need to let you know that this is a general message. Okay. And that energies are fluid and so is time so you can flip the energies and everything like that take what resonates leave the rest it's a possibility that this may not resonate with you at all all right so with that being said thank you thank you thank you for my subscribers for my returning viewers if you have not subscribed please like comment subscribe and share hit that bell notification all right and for those who are new Please like, comment, and subscribe if it resonates with you, okay? And also, if you feel so inclined, please join my membership where you will get a member-only content, exclusive content, and the like, okay? And I will be having some lives. I will be going live um, pretty soon. Um, life has been kind of like busy um, with things so I have not been able to go live like I wanted to but I will be sending out a message to let you know when I'm going live so you can be prepared for it all right and during the lives you can comment live all right and you are able to do the super chats and all of that good stuff that YouTube has afforded me okay and I do thank you so much again all right so for no with no further I do oh my goodness your karmic is talking already yes 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 okay 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 all right here we go and the first card out is it's not my fault he or she keeps coming around me this was the second card that came out it says trying to trap you all right Scared to stand up for you and myself. I don't care if you're in a relationship. Oh, excuse me. All right. And it says, I spent the money you gave him or her. I'm jealous because he has deep feelings for you or she has deep feelings for you. I don't feel worthy enough to find a good man or woman like yours for myself. I added that in there, but yep. I keep falling for unavailable men and women. All right. He or she is into group sex. All right. At the bottom of the deck, it says he or she has learned his karmic lesson. Okay. All right. So let's get into this energy. The karmic is saying it's not my fault that your person is with me or keeps messing with me or keeps coming to me because they keep coming around me. I'm not the one that, that's, that's pushing this. They're pushing this. They're coming around. They like the sex. They're into group sex. And everything. And they all down for it. Okay. They're saying that your person is trying to trap you. So. What I'm getting. Scorpio. Is that. Your person is with you for a reason and they're with this person for a reason. It could be that they like that this person is into the lifestyle sexually that they like. With you, you can have the spiritual things. You might have the money. But because this person is in the type of relationship that they have with your person, they're scared to stand up for you and, and, your, and themselves. So your person may have been talking about you or, oh, you know, they, they're nothing, whatever. So they're scared to do it because they're getting money. 
they're getting something out of it. Maybe they're just getting the sex and they enjoy the sex. That's for someone specific, okay? For others of you, there's a karmic that knows that you're in a relationship and they don't care because they're getting money. And they, they're saying, I spent the money you gave to them. I know that is money that you gave because they told me and I'm the one that spent it. They gave it to me, okay? However, this same person is jealous because your person actually does love you or has deep feelings for you, or at least they're pretending like they do, okay? Because they're not trying to commit to this person at all, okay? So this karmic has low self-esteem and is insecure and say that they don't feel good. They don't feel worthy enough to find a man or woman like yours a good man or woman but however if this person is treating cheating how good could they be i keep falling for unavailable men or women because this person knows that you're in a relationship they don't care but they fell for your person and they keep falling for people who are in relationships but some of you this person is a karmic lesson or was a karmic lesson for your person. They trapped them into whatever situation, whether it's sex, drugs, rock and roll, whatever. Um, so they're saying that they learned a lesson because they went out there and got their behinds tore up. Okay. So let's get find out what's brewing so we can go a little deeper into this situation. All right. Hmm. I did shuffle these. I'm going to just do it one more time. Okay. All right. Somebody's been venting. It could be you. It could be the karmic in the nail salon or it could be your person talking about issues okay somebody thought they were getting sugar that is going to be oh so sweet and it wound up being salt okay somebody was born to shine you were born to shine and your person was born to shine and your person knows that you were born to shine Somebody was copycatting you, either your person, because like I said, this is a spiritual battle. Sometimes the person that you're with is actually the karmic or the person that they're with is the karmic and they've been trying to copycat you, making your person think that they were the one. Okay. You could be in depression, your person could be in depression or the karmic over the situation. Let's just see why. Because there is a time frame on this. Spirit has put a end date to this and this suffering. Okay. For some of you, your person learned a lesson. So that's what the time frame is for them to come back to you. For some of you, your person was trying to write it out for some reason. Maybe the person got pregnant. Maybe they were just in a situation financially. Maybe it was that this person, they're in a relationship with you. For some of you. And the sex was just so mind blowing. They wanted to ride it out and have their cake and eat it too. For some of you, the karmic was just in it for money. As I said in the earlier thing, I spent the money that you gave them. This karmic is a hater. Okay. So they said it. They're jealous of you. They're envious because your person loves you. Okay. This could have been a secret private relationship. And it might be coming out. 
use caution spirit is saying be cautious be cautious be cautious okay for some of you the relationship with the karmic has expired or the relationship that you have with the your person has expired listen to your intuition listen to your the, the, the spirit of the lord Yep, somebody failed to use sexual protection and somebody could have got pregnant or could have gotten a social disease, okay? Somebody has been brainstorming. You might have been brainstorming on a project or trying to get your life together. For those of you that's in the relationship trying to get out because there's just so much drama, all right? But there is a new beginning for you, Scorpio. There is a new beginning for you. All right. Some of you may have been investigating because you may have found a condom in your car, in your house, in your person's clothes when you were washing them. For some of you, the secret could be that your person was on drugs. Now, somebody's insecure. The karmic already said that they were insecure. Maybe you're feeling a little insecure because somebody was putting on a show. It could have been your person or it could have been this karmic to your person. Making them, again, thinking that they was the one. Somebody was copycatting you. Okay. Crush has been coming out a lot. So it could be that your person is crushing on you because they found out that what they had was salt and they thought it was sugar. And they realized how sweet you were. But there's envy from the karmic. And they said that before the situation is about to explode. Okay. And something is going out with the garbage. That relationship is going out with the garbage. All right. Your person may be putting this karmic for some of you. This person is putting the karmic in the place in their place. And the karmic is going to be very angry for some of you. Your person could have anger issues and that might have been what they had to work out in the karmic lessons. So somebody is about to get kicked to the curb. It could be you kicking the person to the curb that you're in a relationship with and they having group sex and all of that stuff. Scorpio, or it could be that the karmic is being kicked to the curb by your person, but somebody is sick. I said that, that they could be bringing a disease, a social disease. So be careful. Somebody was into group sex and may not have been protected. Somebody was having sex with men and women. Wow. I heard somebody was having sex with men, women, and animals. Dang. <laughs> Take that as it resonates. That's not for everybody, but that popped in there. For some of you, your person is coming to fulfill the promise that they had and propose to you. Use caution, though. For some of you, your person has to set the record straight because there was a fake pregnancy, a fake positive, a fake or the, per the child wasn't theirs because again they were having this promiscuous sex and this is all about choices and bad choices and stuff like that I didn't see anything in there about witchcraft or anything else like I did in some of the other readings so this person just was living their best life whether they was in a relationship with you or not so it's up to you if you want to take this person back. 
I can't tell you what to do. I'm just letting you know what's in the cards. All right, let's get some signs out here. All right, so we have Scorpio. You may have been dealing with another Scorpio, Scorpio. We have Taurus. We have Gemini. We have Libra. And we have three. So that is March. So that is Pisces and Aries energy. All right, we have Scorpio again. We have Pisces. We have Aries. And we have a Libra. Remember, like I said, energy can be fluid. You could have been the one messing around, Scorpio. I hope not. But if you were that one, please get tested because <sighs> it came up. Check your health. Check your health. Check your health. And I thank you for coming to the reading. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.